Hello everyone! In this Device Doctor video we'll show you how to enable the USB scanning option on the HP Digital Sender Flow 8500 FN1 after a firmware update. Let's get started! If you're having trouble with your printer, you can fix it for free on your own. If you have any technical questions, or aren't sure which printer to buy, just ask us for expert advice and free support. Step 1. Connect the printer to your computer using a network cable and plug in the power cable. Connect the power cable to the scanner. Then, connect one end of the network cable to the scanner and the other end to your computer. Step 2. Make sure to properly configure the scanner's IP address and write it down. After turning on the scanner, wait for it to fully prepare. To properly configure the IP settings, press the Administration option. Now follow the instructions in the video. A roadmap is also provided on the screen. Step 3. Now click on the network settings in the upper right corner. You will be able to see the correct IP address of the scanner, which you can use to access the scanner settings from your computer. Now enter the IP address into your computer's browser. Note that the IP address may vary for each scanner. You will see the IP address you entered displayed in blue below. Click on it and you will access the scanner settings. Now, click on the general option to display the scanner settings. Now, drag the USB option up to merge it with the active options on the scanner. The scanner option has been added, but note that it is still not active. You need to enable it. Click on configure. And then, according to the video, enable Save to USB. It's very simple. Now, check that this option is activated. Let's go to the scanner to see if the Save to USB option has been properly enabled. Now you can see that the USB option is activated on the scanner screen. Thank you for watching and see you in the next helpful video. Goodbye everyone.